I'm married. <sighs> okay. I didn't tell you. Uh, no, you didn't. I was afraid you wouldn't want to see me again. Well, you're right. But I already know. She did already no, no. know, because she saw the wife. That's a scene from last Sunday's dramatic episode of The Affair as Allison confronts her boyfriend, Ben. Allison is portrayed by actress Ruth Wilson. Ruth Wilson is very busy. She's also in the upcoming supernatural thriller on the big screen. It's called Little Stranger, The Little Stranger. She plays a troubled British aristocrat whose family's life has changed after a doctor is called to care for them. Those marks. Whilst disturbing, even I felt that. They're nothing more than they appear. Now, what about the knocking sound? It's the heating pipes, I imagine. No, we haven't had the heating on for months. And the months. pipes contracting in the cold. Caroline, you mustn't let this business get inside you. It will be explained. <sighs> Where are they? So glad you're here. We're so glad Ruth Wilson is here. <laughs> Welcome back to the table, Ruth Wilson. Hello, lovely to we be want here. to talk about the affair in just a second because yeah. I'm very not happy with how it's ended for your character. <laughs> so we'll get to that in just a second. Okay. Let's talk about the little strange. Yes. This thing, I don't know if it's a it's a supernatural thriller, if it's a psychological thriller. If it's I, as a couple times during the key scenes, I wasn't sure is this real or is it an imagined? Is that what you wanted the viewer to do to go on quite a ride with yeah, you? Yeah, I mean, look, it's an adaptation of a Sarah Novel's book. Yeah, and it does cover lots of different genres. It kind of doesn't stick; to, it's not defined by one. So it's got the structure of a ghost story, yeah. but in that is a psychological yeah. drama, really, and it's a period drama, and it's a family drama, um, and it's a romance, and there's all sorts of things going on. But really, twisted romance, twisted, yeah. yeah. So it's about this doctor comes into this. Crazy crumbling family mansion and things start to go wrong and throughout it's a question whether it's supernatural or is it psychological mm -hmm. um, but yeah it, you are leaving with questions rather yes. than solutions and, and Gail and I have had a debate over who the little stranger <laughs> is yeah. Yeah. yeah well that's up to interpretation I mean I always kind of thought it was it was Donald's it's Faraday's kind of inner beast uh -huh. and he's almost got it's about repressed British people, which all of us are. So you know nothing about repressed British people. I know, no, people. no, no. Yeah. It's like you know, we keep all that motion down, and it comes. If you do that, it's going to come out in some violent, perhaps, and uh -huh. um, uh, it's going to come out some way down the line. And so that's kind of what it's about. It's yeah. sort of, is this a poltergeist? Is it a ghost? Yes. Is it a, is it a demon of your own making? Yes. Um, so that's... Ruth, the, the sort of shabby, chic, aristocracy yeah. period <laughs> thing, yeah. that's a really interesting period, yeah. the nostalgia we have. I'm not even British, but yeah. I have nostalgia for it anyway. We yeah. kind of all do. Well, I think also it's interesting and why I was drawn to this project was the aristocracy in it aren't like the ones in Downton Abbey. They're not glamorous, they're not romanticized. It's not like the crown and you see the royalty. These are people in decline mm -hmm. and they are like grey gardens. It's kind of like grey gardens meets the others. You know, it's sort of, um, these are very eccentric, odd characters mm -hmm. that you find through the wilderness. You know, they sort of come out, these creatures. Mm -hmm. um, and that's why I loved playing it. It was a real character to kind of find and I had fake teeth in I had bum padding I had like hip padding and let's talk about <laughs> the affair please yes. because it yes. you are no longer with the show much to my uh, disappointment but that was such a knockout episode for yeah. you last week because you got to play two very different points of view yes yeah it was a huge sort of challenge it was like a play yeah uh, it was directed by Sam Gold who's a big theater director in New York and um, it was huge we had the differences were very slight but you know um, we had to, we had two weeks in the same room. It's like a chamber piece. Because the question is, is it murder or suicide for Allison? I think it's murder. I definitely I, yeah. think it's. Murder. I mean, it's not. I um, it's not entirely clear. And also, you know, is it the fantasy version of the first half? The second half is reality. Um, I'm not coming back, so she's dead. Did yeah. you? And did, they, they, the word is that you wanted to leave. Is that true? Were you ready um, to leave the show? I did want to leave, but I'm not allowed to talk about why. Oh. You're not what? allowed to talk about why. No. Okay. Okay. We when you leave, well, well uh, Ruth, I'm like, well, wait a second, Ruth, because what I heard was it was a disagreement about money, male and female salaries. You, I've never yeah. complained to Showtime about pay parity. Okay, all right, 
Okay, we'll, oh. we'll leave it at that. It was we, traumatizing. I know. In a good way. But I love what's been amazing to me is the fan response. It's been absolutely, um, yeah. I mean, really moving for me. And to see that a character like this has can connect with people. And for me, what was amazing is, you know, I have people very close to me who've lost kids. So yeah. it was always, for me, really important to serve the story of this woman that is Who defined by a grief. Lost Gabriel. Yeah. I also marvel your British accent, your American accent is oh. so good. Oh, thank yeah. you. Yeah. It's so hard good. to do. Team, team Alison Bailey here. Yeah, team yeah. Alison Bailey. <laughs> Ruth team Wilson. Ruth Wilson. Thank you. Cheering you on always. Thank you, Gail. Always. And you can see The Little Stranger in theater starting August 31st. And the season four finale of The Affair will be on Sunday night. I will be watching on Showtime, a division yes. of CBS.